Today we're gonna to talk about this, a 2CFM battery operated vacuum pump. Is it a gimmick, is it a toy, or is it a game changer? Let's talk about it. A few days ago I did a split system change out. It was a four ton York straight AC, inch and an eighth line sets for a factory that made sunroofs for vehicles. Enough of me trying to make it look cool. Anyway, vacuum pumps have always been one of those really annoying things to have to grab and haul around when you're doing jobs in the HVAC world. But as of 2019, the opportunity will be there to pick up this, the new NAVAC NP2DLM. It is a 2CFM battery operated vacuum pump. It runs on 18 volt. I'm sure you guys are sick of hearing me blabbing. You just want to see something happen. Was it good or bad? Well, see for yourself. What the heck did we just see? I got back to the house to start editing this video and I realized there's hardly even any footage of what happened itself because it happened so quickly. So what you saw, and I'm gonna pull up the screenshot of the Measure Quick final report of the evacuation was a 17 minute start to finish process. So that included our first, our, our rough in vacuum, our mid stage and our deep vacuum, as well as the decay portion of seeing what our rise was after we valved and isolated the pump from the system. We used a two CFM pump with three quarter inch inner diameter hoses and we easily matched the speed that that would have taken somebody with an eight CFM pump with quarter inch hoses, say for example, or going through a manifold. To me, and I said this to myself, that morning even if this was a break-even experiment with time like it did it matched exactly what what a five six seven eight cfm pump could do to me this is still a huge deal and a massive win for the industry to have a product like this because of the convenience factor to not have to find power not even have that be an issue now you're not dragging extension cords you're not dragging out gfci's you're not dragging out your widow makers again is due sometime early next year which means really just a couple weeks from now i would recommend picking up an extra battery it just makes sense if you're going battery to have a spare with you just with anything else that's battery operated with that guys thanks so much again for watching appreciate it as always stay safe out there and we'll see you on the next one